honestly, I'm not even sure I'm going to be able to put this video up. I'm going to try. My my laptop is on on the verge of being dead. I've been putting off getting a new laptop because I can't really afford it. But this has been really buggy. But I've managed to kind of keep it going. It does it does the basic things. It's letting me work on my book. So I've been toughing it out, dealing with the slow the slow whatever speed and the cursor that freezes all the time, etc., etc., etc. Well, last night I failed to close the lid on my laptop. And I've done that before. It's not like it's a huge bad deal, you know. It's probably stupid, considering I have cats. Actually, it was stupid. I found out this morning just how stupid it was when I got up and found someone had vomited on the keyboard. So through the course of the morning, I've managed to get to the, every time I turn it off and turn it back on, it gets a little tiny bit better. Um, it still won't let me type. It still won't let me find um, things in my book. I, if I want to do anything, I have to scroll down. I can't type in my book at all. It won't let me type characters. But what I was able to do after I turned it off and on maybe three or four times was I, fi I was finally able to... Um, drag uh, the latest version of my book over to my external hard drive and drop it in there. So I have the book in its most recent um, form on my external hard drive, which is a huge relief. I, for, for a while this morning I thought I had lost my most recent file, but no, I haven't. I was able to copy my pictures over to the external hard drive too. So now I'm looking at the inevitable need, because I can't type. It won't let me type. It won't let me work on my story. And it's not like I can really stop, because I'm trying really hard to get this thing done. And so I have to go get a new laptop today. And I can't really afford a new laptop. I've been putting up with this slow buggy machine for months and months and months because I can't really afford a new laptop. But here I am. So I'm putting this video up. I have a Patreon account. It's not, I think I have three subscribers. I'm not like super, super Patreon person here. I don't have a lot of people supporting my channel. But I thought just you know, if I put this sad, uh, so sad video up about the death of my laptop and the fact... No, I'm sorry. I, I suck at acting. That's <laughs> why so, hey, we, we didn't stay... We weren't in theater for very long. But anyway, um, yeah. Uh, it's not something I can afford right now. I just... I just... Anyway. So I have a Patreon account. That's it. I just want to let people know I have a Patreon account. This would be a really convenient time for me. It would really help me right now if if any people watching this video feel so inclined as to support me and my channel for a little while to help me uh, be able to afford this laptop, which I can't afford. So that's it. That's me begging and pleading. And I don't have my hat right now or I'd hold it up. My hat. <laughs> Uh, either way, I'm getting the stupid thing today. I have to have it. I have to work on my book because I want my book to be published and it's really important to me. And I can't do anything without my laptop. I don't have another computer. This is my only computer. <laughs> so I need something I can type and edit and stuff with. <laughs> so, and this, this laptop is officially dead now. So... That's it. That's that's the video. I just I just want to let people know I have a Patreon account for my channel. Um, if you feel inclined to support me and my crazy stupid videos that every now and then I I do, which I'm trying to get back on, uh, back in the swing of doing um, anti-religion kind of videos. I went through a, a a point where I was really just anti-Trump videos, but. Really, what's the point? Everybody knows he's a loser. We're screwed. Um, my feeling about Trump is he's a he's a symptom of the disease of Christianity that has infested 
America. So better, my, I feel like it's better to spend my time doing what I was doing before and just attacking religion in general and the fact that it does really poison everything. It's poisoned my country and now we see it in a very horrible way. So I'm going back to uh, what I was doing before more as far as anti-religion, anti-Christianity, anti-cults, anti-poisoning children's minds kind of videos. So, okay, I know I've ended this video now three times. If you've been watching, thanks. Bye.